I'm here with women's soccer head coach Mike Jackson, who's in his 18th season here as head coach of the UNH soccer team. Talk about what it's been like coaching here at UNH. Well, it's been a it's been a great experience, um, dream come true being a being a head coach. You know, I was an assistant for a while with uh, in the Division One level, and uh, just love the New England area. I'm a I'm a New England native, and uh, University of New Hampshire. Just overall, academically, uh, athletically, what it is as an institution, I just was really excited about the opportunity and, and continue to be. Talk about the season so far. You guys have kept it pretty interesting with three double overtime finishes. What has the season been like? Are you guys having fun? You can call it fun. Um, there's some fun along the way, which is important. Um, but yeah, it, it, every game, you know, most games are so close. I don't know what the statistic is, but uh, you might have it. Um, the one goal games, let alone the overtimes that are then golden goal. Um, you know, the, the competition is just so good every, everywhere you turn. Our non-conference and conference included, all those are one goal games, or a lot of them are. And so... Um, you know, you re it really puts pressure on you to, you know, to play what, you know, to play well and focus because you know that, you know, one goal could be the difference. There's not a lot of margin of error. So, uh, our players work hard. I mean, I think we're keeping a good perspective about it, and, um, you know, we're o we're always looking to win and always looking to get better. It's hard to rebound after those one goal losses. I know you get back on the field after those games and work hard the next week and hope to get a W the next weekend. Talk about the girls. Are you proud about how they've been playing so far? Uh, yes, I am. It, you know, resiliency is a word that you hear in the in the coaching world. And um, you know, if your players and you as a staff and head coach don't have it, you know, it's problems because you know it's so unpredictable. You know, the you know you can play you can play well and lose. You can play poorly and win. So you've got to be able to um, you know rebound from wins and losses. And I think you know we have a, a, a strong senior class um, that has grown a lot in their years here. And they're really stepping forward um, and, um, you know, uh, demonstrating consistency and, and the need to be focused on one game at a time. And I'm really pleased with, um, with the growth and maturity of our senior class and the way they're leading, uh, leading the season in their final year. You um, clinched a postseason berth into playoffs this past weekend. Talk about what the playoffs are going to look like for you guys this year. How are you guys preparing? I know you probably have some more sense of urgency in your pregame talks. Talk about postseason for us? Well, postseason is, is always, you know, always what you work for. Um, for us and our goals, it's a, it's a baseline, you know, a baseline goal, and then we put our challenge goals and what we call barrier-breaking goals beyond that. Past number of years, it's come down to the last game, so this is a little bit different for us in knowing with two games left that we're you know, that we're, we've qualified. But there is a huge difference because in our, in our conference, the way the, the postseason tournament is, uh, you know, they seed one through six, and um, one and two get a bye, and then you start right in the semifinals. So our mission now is is to win these games, and because we still are capable of having the two seed and getting a bye in the first round, and then playing at home in a semifinal game. So that in and of itself provides some motivation, but it won't be easy. You know, again, all these games in conference are one goal games and overtime. So, but there is excitement, and there's excitement that we still have the opportunity to host. And as always, we want to win. We want the automatic bid to the NCAA is what, is what we're chasing really hard as well. All right. Well, good luck the rest of the season to you, Coach. Okay. Thank you very much.